Imperative Training is one of the UK's leading first aid training organisations. We have nationwide trainers who we can send anywhere, anytime. Our strength is turning your staff into safe, prompt and effective first aiders and this shows in the high success rate of our learners. We are a dynamic and award-winning organisation that trains the staff of some of the largest and most renowned companies in the UK. Our customers constantly renew their contracts with us because they know we are the best at what we do. And we train twice as many first aiders as all 10 ambulance trusts put together. That's 22,000 qualified first aiders every year. We dedicate an experienced account manager to every imperative client, which guarantees an excellent aftercare service. Clients also have access to our bespoke and innovative management system. So, they can reprint certificates and monitor course progress. Through our comprehensive reminder system, they can also monitor expiring learners and training qualifications. We give help whenever needed and 24-7 support and training. We shape our company to fit your needs and to ensure we can provide the most up-to-date services to cover all your training requirements. We are Imperative Training. We've had lots of phone calls from customers that we've sold defibrillators to that have saved people's lives, um, children's lives, adults' lives. And it's just such a great feeling to know that we've helped in that and the more that we can raise awareness out there, the better. It's just so amazing that one little piece of equipment can save somebody's life. We all understand in this business that it's all about people and the gap that an individual must leave in a family when they've suffered from sudden cardiac arrest and, and and a defibrillator wasn't available to save them um, is immeasurable, isn't it? The mission of the company has been and always will be making a safer environment for everybody out there and just try and reduce the number of deaths caused by cardiac arrest. We're raising awareness about defibrillation and the importance of defibrillation and CPR. We're getting more defibs out into the public domain and I wouldn't do anything else. Well, yeah, to meet someone who's been saved by a defibrillator would be just amazing. You obviously hear people's lives being saved out there, but you never get a chance to meet them. I think it would be a great opportunity to meet somebody that had been saved. I'm Nick, play for a Sunday football team, um, and during one of those Sunday football team matches, I unfortunately had a cardiac arrest. The club had been supplied with a defibrillator equipment by a defib shop, and our coach, Keith, have been trained to use that equipment and it's because of his actions, because of the availability of the defib equipment and because of his actions that I'm still here. I mean you've got the on-site on trainer from, from the specialists from the defib shop. The machine itself actually talks to you. It just talks through the whole procedure from, from A to Z really. So if you were sort of a bit apprehensive and not confident in using the machine, that will just totally change everything around. You know, you take it for granted. I don't even think I, you know, kissed you goodbye that morning. I just, no, you know, it, did no. Actually, no. <laughs> <laughs> That's a normal football morning. Isn't it? <laughs> uh, but it was rushing, and uh, and then I got a phone call, and that's kind of when I felt my whole world collapse. So, but luckily, it didn't, and I'm one of the lucky ones, and that is truly how I feel. One of the blessed, because I don't know what I'd have done, you know, had he died. I would love to meet them, absolutely would love to meet them. In fact, I'm really excited about meeting them because I can't thank them enough for helping to save my life. Okay, whoever it is, man or woman, I'll give them a big hug and a kiss <laughs> to start off with, definitely. When you have somebody come in and thank you and see what, what we've done to help that family, then it just means the world. It's really nice to be able to kind of share that moment and we've got a connection and it's really it does give you a really good feeling. Every single staff member was, uh, has been excited all day long knowing these guys were coming to see us. That's absolutely brilliant. With mean, the greeting we got, yeah. I think there was as much um, admiration and joy for us as, there, you know, real as we had for them. Yeah, a real warmth, definitely. We've got the best job in the world, haven't we? This is as good as it gets. Fabulous. We've been anticipating the moment for, for ages and finally seeing and realising what a lovely bunch of people they are. It's just exhilarating and wonderful. It's just as strange an experience as it's been because you know it's not the sort of thing you want to go through. 
it really is a nice way to, to finish it off, a nice icing on the cake if you will.